to approach here as we uh, continue our show at the Comedy Factory outlet. Um, however, now we are uh, uh, we are going to bring on our next performer, a gentleman who comes to us from To Catch a Rising Star, one of the top clubs in the country, up in New York City, it is. And uh, he has opened for uh, Warren Zevon and Spyro Gyro. He is a terrific act. The impressions and comedy of Mr. Craig Shoemaker. Big round of applause. Come on, come on, come on. crowd. Thank you. Good to be here in the friendly confines of the Comedy Factory Outlet. Happy New Year to all of you. I'll tell you, I have to share something with you. I just played the worst crowd I have ever played before in my life. Brooklyn College in Brooklyn, New York. Anyone familiar with this place? It's all right. It's one of these schools like 210 on your SATs. You're an honors student. And uh, <laughs> they introduced me. It's like 12 o'clock in the afternoon. All the students are drunk as skunks. You know, all these tough Brooklyn types, the Italians, you know, they're sitting out there, you know, with the hair coming out everywhere, out of their backs, out of their ears. <laughs> That's just the women. And um, they introduced me, and Guido and Luigi are sitting in the front row to give me a hard time. You know, it's like, please welcome the comedy Mr. Craig Shoemaker. They're sitting up there going, yo, hey, who the hell is this guy here? Hey, Guido, hey, Guido, look, check him out. He looks like freaking John Boy. <laughs> Hey, come here, John boy. Hey, make me laugh. I believe they said that about me. I don't think I even resemble the guy. I don't know what the hell they're talking about. I... <laughs> you believe he went through life looking like this? <laughs> Looks like Grandma couldn't find the ashtray. Come here, John boy. Grandma, what are you doing? I used to watch that show when I was little. I could never identify that thing on there. What is that, a blackhead? Squeeze that, you pig. <laughs> yeah, the Waltons are a popular show, though. They show the Waltons all over the world now to represent the United States. I was just recently doing a show in India. <laughs> yeah, sure. And uh, <laughs> they have it over there. Over there, it's starring Gundy Boy Walton. <laughs> Good night, Indira Suhu. Good night, Mahatma Bob. <laughs> they love this in 7-Eleven. <laughs> oh, free therapy for my brother. <laughs> yeah. It's good to be back here in Philadelphia. I'm visiting the folks and visiting all, the, all my friends. They take me out on the town now, you know, and I'm going to go celebrate New Year's with them a little later. And, you know, there's my friends celebrating. It's like... You know, we just celebrated the holidays together. It's like, yeah, Craig, man, yeah, good to see you. Yeah, here, have a kamikaze. Here, Southern Comfort. Here, wild turkey. I want to watch you puke. <laughs> Inducing vomiting to them is a happy holiday. And, uh, <laughs> hey, you having a good time? Yeah. <laughs> they take me home to my mother's house at like 3 30, 4 o'clock in the morning. I haven't lived there in several years, but I have to relearn how to sneak into my bedroom. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Keeping the lights out and feeling your way through. This is me, 3 30 in the morning after they shovel me out of the car. Oh, I'm already in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, I know where I'm going here. Well, I got the couches over here somewhere. Where's that couch? Oh, <laughs> oh I got that bookcases over here somewhere. Where is the <laughs> <laughs> you never miss the coffee table. <laughs> it always wakes her up. She has to yell that same stupid question from her bedroom. Craig, is that you? Now, who else does she expect to answer at 3.30 in the morning? <laughs> yeah, Mama, it's me. Where the jewelry? <laughs> Come on, baby, tuck me in. 
always have a seat on the couch. I turn on some old Godzilla movie, you know? <laughs> then I look up, and there she is, Godzilla.